welcome to TLTV, Joy and Pleasure Celebrated in Wine. I'm here today somewhere very special. I'm actually here with probably the smallest domain in Nuit Saint-Georges. And I'm here at the domain of Yves Millière. And Yves Millière is a winemaker that is producing around two and a half thousand bottles a year. And what do we have here today for the tasting? We first of all have a a table wine from Bourgogne retails at six euros a bottle. The other two are 15 euros a bottle, but this is no longer for sale. The Vos Romanée is no longer for sale, but all of them are Pinot Noir. And th this is going to be a great wine adventure. So we just labeled the bottle. I think there's only 15 bottles of this left. And here we have a 2000 bottle and the 2004 only has 15 left. 2000, I think there's around 50 left. Because a lot of people buy the wine if they get a chance, as if you come here, you don't even see that actually there is a domain, there's winemaking. And uh, I'd say let's dive into this wine adventure. This is what wine is all about. And I'm excited because this is so much fun. I'm just staying somewhere and they know the neighbor, they make wine. And six euros a bottle in Nuit Saint Georges is um, pretty much a rare commodity. Let's hope it's tasty. And uh, I brought the Zalto glass. Potentially good wine deserves the best glass possible. And for Pinot Noir, this is great. And you can already see the color. Uh, this, this is absolutely phenomenal. The nose, chocolate. You get a lot of chocolate in the nose. Has really nice licorice. Has very soft tannins has a lot of fruit it's very enjoyable and for six euro i have never in my life have tasted a better bottle because i remember domain krupp in germany where i had a beautiful pinot noir it was seven euro twenty and this is this is it's it's a genius wine you could easily charge double or three times the price for six euros this is this is incredible but there's almost no wine left. You can see a few bottles behind me, if you can see that in the, in the crates there. And that's pretty much it, all is gone. For me, wine like this, 88 points. Um, if you get a chance, drink it, buy it, drink it. Uh, absolutely fantastic. And now we continue to the next wine. And that is the Vos Romanée. And the label is just on the bottles. We just got it out of the cellar a while back. So the glue is actually still drying. We just put the bottle the label on for the camera as there is no actual uh, vintage sign. We didn't have any anymore. There's only 15 bottles left, so be it. Uh, but if we look at the color, and I hope you can see that, this is very dark red. Of course, it's Pinot Noir as well, and I'll be interested about... The nose is barnyard. This smells like barnyard to the utmost and has wonderful tenants this is a wine to enjoy with food and i think i'll have that tonight with a beautiful steak or entrecot this is a wine delight um 2004 was before of course the, the big vintage but was a very average year this is a delightful wine um you get now some fungi. This is this is fantastic. Um, I really, for me, this is this is 90, 91 points. I really, this is this is big wine. Uh, why is this big wine? It has no flaws. It has wonderful tannins. Um, it's really big in the sense flavor. It's very powerful in the mouth, and hmm. Mm. This is just fantastic. So now we go to the last bottle, and that is a uh, Nuit Saint uh, Georges uh, Village. No? Yeah. Uh, Nuit Saint Georges Village, 2000, millennium wine, 15 years old. And already the way it pours out of the bottle, you can already see that it is completely dark and brown, and it has like a long time, let's say, in the making. The nose, dry fruit, a little bit of forest floor. Um, 
absolutely delightful. Um, the price 15 euros, you can't buy this anymore, but would have been roughly the same. For 15 euros, uh, incredible. Uh, this is this is this is big. Uh, just the nose, I haven't even tasted it yet. Nice taste, a lot of fruit, you get your cherries. Um, the tannins are a little bit subdued, that is a shame. Um, very enjoyable, this, this is like, it's still very fresh, very youthful. A little bit like the winemaker, which is a very youthful person as well, as he's still making wonderful wines in a, in a, in a, in a what, let's say, some older age and a chapeau for him. Because this, this is great, but for me, this is like 87. This is okay, it's a very nice wine. But this here, this is, this is very, very special. And uh, I truly appreciate having the privilege of tasting it, as there's only a few bottles left of this. I hope I can enjoy this for dinner tonight, as this is perfection. So a big thank you for letting me taste the wines. Um, another wine adventure complete, and this is fantastic. If you get a chance, buy the bottles. This is absolutely delightful. Um, a little wine adventures come to an end. So I say I close this off. A big thank you to uh, Monsieur uh, Yvon Millier. Absolutely fantastic. Um, no. A big merci to uh, Monsieur Yvon Millier uh, for the wonderful wines. Uh, the possibility of actually tasting this. Uh, a big chapeau and uh, a gros merci. And for me, let's sign off this wine adventure with, uh, as always, wonderful wines, wonderful food I wish you, of course, wonderful people and great wine adventures. Until the next time, see you again at TLTV. Bye-bye. Ciao.